ஓம் சாந்தி மார்னிங் ஒல்லி சிக்ஸ்டீன் செப்டம்பர் ஸ்வீட் லெட்டர் ஆஃப் பாக்தாதா ஃபார் ஸ்வீட் ஸ்வீட் சில்ட்ரன் ஆசன்ஸ் ஸ்வீட் சில்ட்ரன் திஸ் இஸ் அ வண்டர்ஃபுல் ப்ளே அபவுட் பீங் வர்த்தி ஆஃப் வர்ஷிப் அண்ட் வர்ஷிப்பர்ஸ் அபவுட் நாலேஜ் அண்ட் டிவோஷன் ஸ்வீட் சில்ட்ரன் திஸ் இஸ் அ வண்டர்ஃபுல் ப்ளே அபவுட் பீங் வர்த்தி ஆஃப் வர்ஷிப் அண்ட் வர்ஷிப்பர்ஸ் அபவுட் நாலேஜ் அண்ட் டிவோஷன் You now have to become Sato Pradhan and worthy of worship once again and also end all signs of impurity. Question When the father comes what scales does he show you children? When the father comes what scales does he show you children? Answer the scales of knowledge and devotion. on one side of the scales is knowledge and on the other side is devotion the side of knowledge is now light and that of devotion is heavy gradually the side of knowledge will become heavy and then in the golden age there will be just one side of the scales there is no need for scales there om shanti the spiritual father explains to you sweetest spiritual children the secret of knowledge and devotion you children also know that the father has now truly come and is once again making you into worthy of worship deities those who became the devilish community are now once again becoming the deity community that is devotion is now ending in this cycle you also now know when devotion begin and when ravan's kingdom begin and when it ends and then when rama's kingdom begin you children have the history and geography of the world in your intellects there are truly four ages now the city of the drama of the confluence age is continuing all of this is in the intellects of you children in whose intellects are all of these things they are now in the intellects of the brahmans who are the mouth born creation of prajapita brahma some name has to be mentioned you cannot mention any name other than that of brahmans the play is created in this way brahmans then deity then warriors this cycle continues to turn in this way you children are now learning the pilgrimage of remembrance that is you are becoming pure from impure so you have to explain in this way we are now establishing rama's kingdom and it would therefore surely be ravan's kingdom before that we are now establishing rama's kingdom and it would therefore surely be ravan's kingdom before that because it is not ravan's kingdom it also proves that the tree is very big we are now establishing the religion of worthy of worship deities the old tree is come to an end and the establishment of the new one is taking place you children understand this account we ourselves were worthy of worship and sato pradhan and then having taken 84 births we have become tamo pradhan from being worthy of worship we have become worshipers and this has to repeat it is easy to understood how the cycle has continued to turn it is like actors who play their parts from the beginning to the end so this is an unlimited secret it is the secret of knowledge and devotion which is now very clearly embedded in your intellects we were worthy of worship golden age deities and then we came down the ladder and became worshipers you know the accurate date and time when ravan's kingdom begins we have taken rebirth in this way at first we were sun dynasty deities and then we become part of the moon dynasty we have now become the dynasty of brahmans and we will then become deities so you are now the brahman dynasty of or god's dynasty you are now the brahman's dynasty or god's dynasty all of you know that you are all the children of god and this is why you say that you are brothers 
in fact brothers are in the incorporeal world and then you have to come down to play your parts you children know that you change from shudras into brahmans and then after studying you carry those sanskars with you you are becoming deities yesterday we were shudras and today we are brahmans and tomorrow we will become deities you children have to explain this secret you have to awaken everyone you can explain to anyone that the new world is the golden age and that the old world is the iron age there is no happiness here you children understand that when the tree was new we were deities and there was a lot of happiness then as we continue to go around the cycle the world became old the number of human beings increased a lot and so did sorrow the father explains how you were so happy in the golden age no one remains happy forever it is the law to take rebirth having gone through rebirth and having coming down your 84 births have now come to an end the cycle has to turn a new knowledge and devotion for half the cycle it is the day the new world and then for half the cycle it is the night the old world so you have to remember this study you also have to remember shiv baba the teacher remembers everything you say that baba has the knowledge of this whole world you also understand that you who were pure worthy of worship deities have now become impure worshipers so you understand the stages of sato pradhan sato rajo and tamo and the history and geography of the drama this play about being worthy of worship and worshipper is predestined talk to yourself in this way the main things needed to become sato pradhan are knowledge and yoga the knowledge is of the word cycle and we become pure by having yoga it is so easy you too can explain to anyone just as baba explains baba is saying you too can explain to anyone just as baba explains it is just that baba does not go outside because the father is with him no human being knows about salvation it is only when they understand the things of salvation that they can recognize the best ever of salvation you too know this number wise you understand this and you also explain to others the main thing is to become pure from impure so it is only by having remembrance that you will become sato pradhan from tamo pradhan some children here and also children outside us how can we have yoga how can we have yoga and what is the way to become pure from impure because they are confused about this therefore you should explain to them that this play has been created about victory and defeat it is bharat that becomes pure from impure and impure from pure for half a cycle there is knowledge that is it is pure and for half a cycle there is devotion that is it is impure so you now have to become pure from impure once again the ancient pilgrimage of remembrance is very well known those people go on physical pilgrimages for birth after birth and continue to come down it is not that they became pure through that it is only the one father who purifies you he only comes once you would not say that shiv baba takes rebirth it is only human beings who have to go around the cycle of 84 births baba says this story is very easy it is just that you definitely have to change your character when you were deities your characters were first class then your characters gradually began to be spoiled now in ravan's kingdom they have been completely spoiled you bring impure for half the cycle on the path of devotion has resulted in a lot of upheaval from being the pure temple of shiva 
इट बिकेम द इम्प्योर ब्रोथर इट ब्रिंग इट बिकेम द इम्प्योर ब्रोथल रावण कंकर यू नो वन इवन ट्राइज टू क्रिएट द किंगडम ऑफ रामा द फादर हिमसेल्फ हैज टू कम दिस इज ऑल्सो पिड स्टैंड इन द ड्रामा वी हैव कंटिन्यू टू फॉल इन द किंगडम ऑफ रावण एंड वी नाउ हैव टू क्लाइंब अप द फादर कम्स एंड अवेकन्स यू बिकॉज एवरी वन इज स्लीपिंग इन डिवोशन इवन दो द फादर हैज कम दे आर स्टिल स्लीपिंग द फादर कम्स एट द एंड वैन ऑल आर स्लीपिंग इन द स्लीप ऑफ इग्नोरेंस जस्ट एज द फादर इज द ओशन ऑफ नॉलेज एंड नोज द बिगनिंग द मिडल एंड एंड ऑफ द वर्ल्ड सो यू ऑल्सो नो इट ऑल ऑफ यू मैनी चिल्ड्रन स्टडी विद द फादर यू स्टडी विद द वन फादर एंड देन एक्सपेंशन टेक्स प्लेस यू वर मेड इन टू डिटीज फ्रॉम ह्यूमन बींग्स इन द प्रीवियस साइकल टू सो यू नाउ डेफिनेटली हैव टू बिकम दैट सम मेक वेरी लाइट एफर्ट्स एंड सम मेक वेरी इंटेंस एफर्ट इट इज नंबर वाइज सम हैव डल इंटेलेक्ट्स इट इज नंबर वाइज इन वर्ल्डली स्कूल्स टू देर आर सो मैनी क्लासेज फॉर अ बी एंड एम ए इन अदर स्टडीज सो मैनी पीपल स्टडी फॉर दोज सो मैनी पीपल इन द वर्ल्ड वुड बी स्टडिंग फॉर एन एम ए ऑल द पीपल ऑफ भारत हैव बिन स्टडिंग फॉर सो लॉन्ग सम बिकम टीचर्स एंड सम बिकम समथिंग एल्स दे कंटिन्यू टू अर्न देयर लाइवलीहुड अच्छा इफ दे डाई If they die, they have to take a new birth and start studying refresh. There, in the golden age, there is no study for an MA, etc. It is fixed in the drama for this time, and you study it, and you will then study again. After a cycle, there there are no books, etc. Whatever happens on the path of devotion does not happen on the path of knowledge. on the path of devotion they teach whether happened in the whatever happened in the past the father has told you when it is rama's kingdom and when it is ravan's kingdom and how we have continued to come down all of these secrets have set in your intellects very well you now have to make effort to become the highest of all however not every can be one can become the same in a kingdom some make very good effort and imbibe divine virtues to become pure you have a godly register you have a godly register check yourself to see that you have no defects i am virtuous and have no virtues everyone understands that they have defects when we had all the virtues we were 16 celestial degrees full it was their kingdom there are the pictures of them there are the pictures of them these temples etc will not exist there there would not be any trace of the path of devotion there then on the path of devotion there would not be slightest trace of knowledge so you know this number wise those who study well and imbibe everything continue to develop these qualifications it enters your hearts how much you should become helpers of the father from whom you claim the sovereignty of the world we are god's children the father has come to make you all into the best ever's of happiness he never causes anyone sorrow you children have to become so elevated baba repeatedly tells you note down whether you have caused anyone sorrow the father gives everyone happiness so we too should give happiness we have given this life for baba's service make effort to become very sweet make effort to become very sweet even if some says wrong thing just stay quiet give everyone happiness show everyone the path of to happiness so that you can become masters of the land of peace and the land of happiness you have to become best towards of happiness because the father is constantly the best ever of happiness he removes everyone's sorrow 
it enters your intellect that you were those who gave a lot of happiness when we were in happiness there was no name or trace for vice we did not use the lord sword of lust in the golden age no one makes anyone han- unhappy the father continues to tell you children consider yourself to be souls it is souls that have to become pure no sign of impurity should remain in your souls you will continue to progress day by day you claimed the kingdom number wise according to the efforts you made you are now making effort to claim the that same kingdom again so you continue to see how much effort each one makes to how many do i give happiness you children know that you will not cause sorrow for anyone in the golden age if you make less effort there will be punishment and a low status will be received you will lose your honor some children continue to do a lot of service they make so much effort at the museum and exhibitions these exhibitions and museum etc will continue to grow on the scales the side of knowledge will continue to become heavier on one side is knowledge and on the other side is devotion so at this time the devotion side is so heavy that it is going right down to the ground it will become very heavy and go out down to the bottom it will seem as though there are 10 kilos in one side and just a quarter of a kilo of knowledge on other side the side of knowledge will then become heavy in the golden age there is just the one side of scales and then in the iron age there is just the other side at the confluence age there are the two sides there are so few people on the side of knowledge it is so light then they will be transformed from that side and continue to fill this side and then devotion will end and just the side of knowledge will remain there will no longer be two sides the father comes and shows you the scales it continues to be less and more sometimes there are more on that side and at other times there are more on one side this side they come into knowledge and then become members of the devotion side those who are strong know that establishment definitely has to take place when it is our kingdom only we will exist then the side of the incorporeal world will become heavier many souls will remain there so that side will become heavier then from the copper age onward after half the cycle they will continue to come down the world cycle continues to turn in this way when you are impure there is no need for scales scales are only needed when the father comes the father brings the scales with him so you have the knowledge of the tree in your intellects at first a tree is very small and then it continues to grow all the leaves dry up and finish and it then repeat when it receives water small leaves grow it also bears fruit the tree becomes bare every year everything will become new now there is not a single person of the dt religion now there is not a single person of the dt religion they definitely did exist it used to be their kingdom but when but when people have forgotten this the clan of you brahmans also continue to grow day by day therefore churn this knowledge in this way and continue to imbibe it and explain it to others acha to the sweetest beloved long lost and now found children love remembrance and good morning from the mother the father bap dada the spiritual father says namaste to the spiritual children and who spiritual children says namaste good morning to our sweetest spiritual father essence for dharna engage this life of yours in the father's service 
engage this life of yours in the father's service become a bestower of a lot of happiness if someone says wrong things keep quiet become equal to the father in removing everyone's sorrow second check out your own register check your own register imbibe divine virtues and become one with a god good character become one with a good character remove all defects today's blessing feel baba's hand on your head and take blessing may you be free from looking at others and become a conqueror of maya by having the awareness of your title of a spinner of the disc of self realization may you be free from looking at others and become a conqueror of maya by having the awareness of your title of a spinner of the discus of self realization at the confluence the father gives you children different titles keep these titles in your awareness and you will easily be able to stabilize yourself in an elevated stage don't just describe them with intellects but go set on the seat as the title is let your stage become that when you have the title of being a spinner of the discus of self realization in your awareness you will not look at others a spinner of the discus of self realization means a conqueror of maya maya will then not have the courage to come in front of you no one can stay in front of the discus of self realization no one can stay in front of the discus of self realization slogan experience the stage of retirement and give others this experience and all childish games will finish experience the stage of retirement and give others this experience and all childish game will finish om shanti thank you baba